वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स टू द क्विक सोल्यूशन ऑफ ऑल इंडिया आकाश टेस्ट सीरीज मेडिकल 2020 दिस इज ओ आई एम दैट इज वन ईयर मेडिकल एंड कैरी फॉरवर्ड टेस्ट नंबर सेवन कोड ए एंड बी फॉर केमिस्ट्री कंडक्टेड ऑन नाइनटीन ऑफ जनवरी टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी स्टार्टिंग विद द वेरी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन ऑफ केमिस्ट्री स्टूडेंट्स विच इज क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी सिक्स लेट्स रीड द क्वेश्चन स्टूडेंट्स करेक्ट ऑर्डर ऑफ मेल्टिंग पॉइंट ऑफ एल्कली मेटल्स potassium rubidium sodium and lithium is student as we know on moving top to bottom in a group the atomic size increases and because of which the metallic bonding decreases which ultimately results in decrease in melting point so the correct order of melting point of alkali metals is the maximum boiling point is of lithium followed by sodium then potassium and then rubidium that means the correct order is option number 2 moving to the next question students which is 47 which among the following does not undergo disproportionation reaction in alkaline medium the options are p4 s8 cl2 or f2 student this is a very important question as we all know that f2 will not disproportionate as we all know that fluorine cannot exhibit positive oxidation state in its compounds because fluorine is the most electronegative element so among the given options fluorine does not undergoes disproportionation i am also writing the disproportionation reaction of p4s8 and cl2 so starting with the disproportionation first we have p4 in which the oxidation state of phosphorus is 0 in basic medium it disproportionates to give ph3 in which the oxidation state of phosphorus is minus 3 plus h2po2 minus in which the oxidation state of phosphorus is plus 1 so class it is very clear that in this reaction phosphorus is oxidized and reduced simultaneously so this is a disproportionation reaction of phosphorus moving to s8 here the oxidation state of sulfur is 0 in basic medium it gives 4 s2 minus plus 2 s2o3 2 minus plus 6 H2O. Here the oxidation state of sulfur is minus two, and in S2O3, two minus the oxidation state of sulfur is plus two. So it is very clear the oxidation state of sulfur changes from zero to minus two as well as to plus two. That means this reaction is a disproportionation reaction. Moving to the third option, which is Cl2 in basic medium converts to ClO minus plus Cl minus. Plus H two O. Here the oxidation state of chlorine is plus one, and here it is minus one. So it is very clear that the oxidation state of chlorine changes from zero to plus one as well as to minus one. That means this is also a disproportionation reaction. Moving to F two in basic medium, F two changes to F minus and O F two. in the product fluorine has minus 1 oxidation state here also and here also fluorine has minus 1 oxidation state that means the last reaction is not a disproportionation reaction so it is very clear that among p4 shcl2 and f2 f2 will not undergo disproportionation reaction so the correct answer is option number 4 moving to the next question students which is 48 Consider the following redox reaction: MnO4 minus plus S2O32 minus plus H2O gives MnO2 plus SO42 minus plus OH minus. Now, mole of thiosulfate required per mole of permanganate ion for complete reaction is. Student, for this question, first of all, we need a balanced equation. So, student, this is the balanced equation. Now, students, it is very clear that eight moles. of mno4 minus reacts with 3 moles of thiosulfate that is s2o32 minus so 1 mole of mno4 minus will react with 3 by 8 mole of s2o32 minus so it is very clear the correct answer is option number 2 
मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन स्टूडेंट विच इज फोर्टी नाइन ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट ऑफ फोस्फोरस इन पी एच थ्री एच थ्री पीओ थ्री एच थ्री पीओ टू and H3PO4 follows the order. Student, in this case, we have to calculate the oxidation state of phosphorus in the given four compounds, and then we'll be able to arrange these four compounds in the increasing order of oxidation state. So let's start with the oxidation state of phosphorus in PH3. Here, let's assume the oxidation state of phosphorus as X, and the oxidation state of hydrogen is plus one. So X plus three is equals to zero. So X is equals to minus three. Moving to the next molecule, which is H three PO three. Hydrogen is plus one. Phosphorus is X. Oxygen is minus two. So plus three plus X minus six is equals to zero. X minus three is equals to zero. X is equals to plus three. Moving to the next molecule, which is H three PO two. H is plus one, then plus X, then minus two. So plus three. Plus x minus four is equals to zero. X minus one is equals to zero, and x is equals to plus one. Moving to the last molecule, which is H three PO four. H is plus one, then plus x, then minus two. So plus three plus x minus eight is equals to zero. So x is equals to plus five. So student, the correct order is. H three PO four followed by H three PO three further followed by H three PO two and the least oxidation state of phosphorus is in PH three. That means the correct answer is option number two. Moving to the next question, students, which is question number fifty. Standard reduction potential of three redox couples, that is x two plus x, y two plus y, z two plus z, are minus one point five volt, minus zero point five volt, plus one point five volt respectively. The reducing power of x, y, z follows the order. Student, as we all know, lower is the standard reduction potential value, higher will be the reducing power. So we are given that the standard reduction potential of x two plus X is equals to minus one point five volt. The reduction potential rate of y two plus y is equals to minus zero point five volt, and the reduction potential of z is plus one point five volt. That means order of reducing power will be. X followed by Y followed by Z. Since the value of reduction potential of X is least and the value of reduction potential of Z is highest, so X will have the highest reducing power and Z will have the least reducing power. That means the correct answer is option number three. Moving to the next question, students, which is fifty-one. 